the beautiful river city of Wanganui and the home of my iwi. Ah! Oyo! Anyways, today is not about me or scary hoi ho. Today is about this cousin. He's been river guiding since he was a teen. He's the CEO of Wanganui River Tours and takes people from all over the world on cultural experiences down the Wanganui River. So tell me about this place, where are we? Um, we're at One River. One River is like um, basically a place where um, when we were up and coming teens coming through the ranks of uh, river guiding and providing, practicing and learning how to navigate on our hour. This was kind of a, the, the core place that all of us young bucks um, come and hang out with our aunties and uncles. Koyora is one of the bros who's um, kind of been a part of this right from the beginning. I think the best thing about Shaw is he's really good at being himself. And when we're promoting ourselves and being from Whanganui and being um, river rats, that's the best thing that we can put forward, is putting your best self forward, and he does that really well. Most people hate their jobs. You know, we love doing this. Toyota is a trained navigator and has sailed all over the world on traditional waka. He starred in a television series, Waka Warriors, and he even knows how to build his own waka. If you see anybody in the river without a life jacket, let them know. Our river is a beautiful place, but you know, it's also got its hazards and its risks. Biggest job is just the Manaki our manuhiri that come along. You know, we just want our, our whānau or our manuhiri to enjoy their trip as much as possible without getting hurt. Through safety briefings and that kind of stuff, you know, we're able to educate them on, on ways of doing it. So I got an off-season in basketball. If I wanted to work with you, what do I need to have? Having the right attitude is really, really important. You have to be passionate. Passionate about what you're doing, passionate about creating spaces where people can have fun in a safe way. When you're out in the middle of nowhere, anything can happen. Being able to think and use your own initiative in the moment is a key part. And we need to ensure that people that are responsible for other people and their lives, they really need to know um, how to communicate quickly, think sharp and make informed decisions off their feet. Half of us live and breathe the river um, throughout our whole lives, not just the summer season. So, yeah, it's just a big part of us. And being able to come on it, you know, doing trips like this, that's pretty cool. It's important for anyone in our team to be positive, to look really good, and... <laughs> Smiling is key, eh? Yep. You know, it's amazing how many people you can kind of um, attract with a smile. With a smile. The ability to um, navigate a canoe and or learn to do so, being able to talk. I know you like to talk. <laughs> is key, especially when you're trying to um, engage people and keep them happy. Sure. So all I have to do is have a positive attitude be able to solve problems quickly and be passionate about my mahi and I can work at the Wanganui River Tours. Here yeah, boy! You can actually live your life and just be you. Like, be Māori, be from the river and get paid for it. <laughs> These guys are a pretty friendly and happy bunch, right? That's because they love what they do and they're doing what they love. And they want that from you too. So show them, be interested, Tell them about your passions, share your goals. Kara Fiwa. Check out more awesome Māori business stories in the video section. Or visit careers.govt.nz slash Maya.